This video will discuss selective laser melting partial denture frameworks. Since 2006, Rowe Dental Laboratory has fabricated digital partial frames. For many years, we simply used the software to design partials based on a scan of a model. The software would help us design the frame, block out undercut, find the path of insertion, and then use mathematical principles and basic principles of partial framework to design ideal frameworks that fit and looked great. The drawback with the, that older type of technology is that once the framework was designed, it was printed in resin or wax, and then it was cast. And when you print wax or resin, and when you cast, there are many variables to be taken into account. And often frames would be distorted, would not come out perfectly due to these variables. However, today with selective laser melting, the file that is designed goes into a software, goes into a special selective laser printing machine where lasers will contact the chrome cobalt particles and fabricate the frame. And it is a one-to-one. -one. In other words, whatever we design on the screen with the software becomes the partial. As you can see here, there are some examples of these partial frameworks. Some frames that we design are still from, uh, uh, from scans of casts. So the, the doctor will send in the normal traditional records and we will draw a basic design of the frame and then we'll bring it in the software, design the frame, print a resin model for fitting and preserve the master cast. It's always nice to have a duplicate model. In fact, it's really necessary to have a duplicate model for a partial because we're going to do the processing of the acrylic on the master cast. But for fitting and verification and shipping, we, we send it out on a resin model. And as you can see, these frameworks are very aesthetic. They're well designed. You see the very nice finish lines. You can see here on this nice lower partial. Finish lines, the high shine, the design of it. The computer will make sure that these types of clasps are put in the perfect position for draw and for undercut, for clasping. The software will also make that the taper of the clasping and the design of the clasping ideal, following the standards and rules of partial dentures. Some doctors, of course, still send in conventional casts and we can make a, a frame that fits very well in those situations. And some doctors also today have digital impression scanners. And on those cases, uh, as long as the doctor can capture the tissue area of course the teeth area, but the tissue area perfectly, then we can also design a partial frame on these, uh, on these models. It is critical though that great care is taken to scan the patient because often with free end or large areas where there is tissue, scanners can get lost and confused because of the shiny surface. So just be very cautious when scanning and evaluating your scans that the that the impression was taken perfectly. What we found over the years is that dental technology has drifted a little bit away from the art and science of the manual work to make a partial frame. But with selective laser melting and sophisticated software, partial frames have made a great comeback and are a very predictable system and modality for making partial frame that fit and look great and have a high degree of acceptance from both a fit and aesthetic and design perspective. Try Rowe Dental Laboratory for an SL frame today.